South Korea is calling for international cooperation to fight air pollution and climate change, and it will first step up the partnership with China. Lee kyung hoon reports. South Korea and China will strengthen their cooperation to reduce fine dust pollution. Environment Minister Cho myung ne and his Chinese counterpart Lee kang met on Monday in Seoul and signed an action plan for the so-called Clear Sky Project. The two first proposed a plan back in February, and they agreed to hold policy consultations on an annual basis to curb air pollution. Now the action plan will take the form of tangible efforts through cooperation in three areas, policy and information exchanges, joint research, and the commercialization of technology. In particular, the two sides will exchange information on fine dust forecasting. Also, South Korea will install environmentally friendly technology in China's coal-fired power plants, and China will expand the number of cities subject to joint monitoring of air quality. Also Monday, the Chinese Environment Minister attended an international forum in Seoul on air pollution and climate change, where South Korean Prime Minister Lee nak was also present. There, the prime minister stressed the importance of regional cooperation in tackling climate action, saying that air pollution transcends national boundaries, so it can only be solved through transnational efforts. In line with that, he said the results of a joint study by South Korea, China and Japan will be released this month. Lee kang echoed the importance of working together. He said China plans to give top priority to environmental issues and will increase cooperation and exchanges with other countries. China's role is especially important as a large portion of Korea's fine dust is believed to blow in from China while the major domestic contributor is exhaust gas. Lee Kang-un, Arirang News.